new trailer application of Flow Restore takes less than two hours from start to finish and involves four steps. One, vacuuming the trailer floor. Two, mixing the Flow Restore. Three, applying the Flow Restore. Four, putting the trailer into service within 24 hours. Before you start, be sure you have the right kit for the job. Key Polymer Floor Restore is available in kit size for typical 28, 48, and 53-foot closed trailers and truck bodies. Here are the tools you'll need for the job. The kit includes the Floor Restore Parts A and B, gloves, stir stick, squeegee blade, and instructions. You will need to provide a screwdriver to open containers, broom handle for squeegee, a shop vac, craft paper, and masking tape. For the very best results, take five minutes to read the instructions included in the kit. Before application, store the kit at 65 to 75 degrees Fahrenheit for at least 24 hours. If the work area is less than 65 degrees, warm the trailer beforehand with a torpedo heater. Remove the heater from the trailer before starting the job. The temperature must be between 65 and 85 degrees when you apply Floor Restore. At higher temperature, the product may cure before the installation is complete. Floor Restore will not cure properly if the temperature is colder. Step 1. Vacuum the floor. Floor preparation in a new trailer is minimal. Simply vacuum the floor with a shop vac. If the floor has metal plates, it will be necessary to mask these off with craft paper. Step 2. Mix the floor restore. Pour one Part B container into Part A container and mix for 5 minutes with the stir stick provided. When mixing, be sure to scrape the container sidewalls as you stir. Make sure the mixture is a uniformly blended color without streaks. Step 3. Apply the Floor Restore. Pour one quarter of the mixed Floor Restore across the floor at the nose of the trailer. Use the squeegee to draw the Floor Restore back. Draw the Floor Restore back 4-5 to five feet from the trailer nose with an even, firm motion. Work the material into the screw holes and wood. Always go with the grain. Before the last pass, Remove any excess material from the squeegee by rubbing it clean onto an untreated section of the floor. Make one final pass over your treated area with the squeegee, applying firm pressure. The floor restore will soak into the wood and between the boards, reinforcing the laminations. Pour the rest of the floor restore you've mixed across the floor where you left off and continue the application. When all the mixed floor restore has been used, combine and mix the second half of the kit and continue the application. Make sure the trailer is kept at least 65 degrees for a minimum of 24 hours to ensure a cure. In winter, if the trailer cannot be kept in a heated shop, use a cargo heater or torpedo heater before and after the application. If there is any residual tackiness, the floor restore may not be fully cured. Just run the torpedo heater for a few hours to finish the cure. Floor Restore is distributed by leading truck and trailer parts specialists throughout North America. To locate your nearest dealer, or if you have questions, please call 978-683-9411 or email us at sales at keypolymer.com. For complete details on all Key Polymer products, visit keytransportationproducts.com. Key Polymer Floor Store, the tough, economical solution for protecting your new wooden trailer floor.